Good morning everyone and happy Sunday. It's actually about to be noon right now. I just woke up like an hour ago. I am on my computer right now because I have joined a 12 week challenge group. She reached out to me a couple of days ago and asked if I was interested in joining. So I don't know that much about it right now just because like I said I had a really busy weekend and I didn't really have time to like look into it and see all the details. But anything with fitness or health challenge, I'm all for it. And I'm just so in love with the way everything has kind of just worked out in my favor. And that's how I just know it's confirmation from the universe that this is my time where i am at on okay so a lot of you know i have not shared my weight goals i mean my weight with anyone really because when i first started my journey which was i think like over a year ago it was very weight focused i just you know found myself stressing out when the scale wasn't moving and I felt like I felt like I was ashamed because here I am, like starting a whole page. I felt weight loss and my scale ain't moving or it's I'm gaining weight. So like I haven't been focused on the number on the scale this whole time. I've just been going based off, off of how I feel. Um, Let's just get on the scale, okay? We'll worry about that right from right now. Let's get on the scale. So. Don't mind my little fat toes, y'all. Here we go. 222 pounds. Body fat 47. Muscle 25. Water 43. Bone 3.3. BMI 38.1. It's not horrible. So I weigh 222 pounds. All right. And I have set my intentions to work towards my goal which will be 195 by July. Well, it's set. It's done. Um, I'm going to have to find a way to submit that on the page. What's up guys? Today is Thursday and I guess officially day four of my 12 week weight loss slash fitness challenge I signed up for recently. Um, but it's just like a common trend lately that certain things just don't make me feel good anymore. It's especially difficult when I've been eating like as raw and as clean as I have been. And then I turn around and eat something that's a little oily or dairy-y or I don't know what it is. Chemically, like, I think my body is like, <laughs> Before we even waste our time to digest this, let me let you know now that this is not, this is not gonna work for us. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and head in the frozen section and go get some. We, we froze some fresh blueberries, raspberries, and mangoes, I believe. We froze some fresh ones, chopped them up, bought them fresh, chopped them up, put them in freezer bags and stuck them in the freezer so I can make smoothies. And I think um, normally I would add like juice for the liquid, but juice has so much sugar in it that like really we're trying to work on this, okay? So I'm going to try something new and I'm just gonna make it with almond milk and hope and pray that the natural sugars from the fruit are enough for me. And if it's not, then maybe I'll try to add a little bit of honey, but
but it has a strange taste to it. it tastes like onions because of the onions that are in the refrigerator that I thought were sealed up. Even yesterday, my jade roller, I used it and I was like, why does my face smell like onions? Some onions. Wow, this is just eating through the bag, like no respect to anybody. Okay, lesson learned. Good morning, y'all. I woke up feeling skinty this morning. My stomach is visibly thinner. Um, it's just more deflated, I guess. It's a good way to put it. Just more together. Like, I don't know. I haven't been able to say this in a long time because for a long time, it was heading in the opposite direction. Just bigger, fluffier, heavier, however you want to name it. I was gaining weight. And now that I, it's only been a week of pure... Okay, I can't say pure. It hasn't been perfect. But it's been a week of intentional eating. And I can even say, like, my workouts have not been all the way on um, towards the end of the week. Thursday, I didn't get in as good as a workout as I hoped. But I did still work out. And I still burned calories. But I personally don't feel like I got it unless I did, like, a drip sweat kind of deal. Sore, you know but i just am starting to feel like tired very tired towards the end of the week and it may be because my body is just going through changes and i've been pushing myself just like a little bit harder and on top of that i'm not um eating as many carbs and being trying to be very mindful of that so my i think my body is just like what is going on we're going through some sort of transition but i don't necessarily have all that energy to give towards it I didn't really eat. <laughs> Yesterday I had a um, granola bar. I had a veggie Mediterranean sandwich from Panera. No meat in it. It did have feta in it, however. And then when I got to the mall, of course, there's not that many options like in the food court area, but we didn't have enough time to sit somewhere. So we, um, I got a chicken Philly cheesesteak. That was a mistake because my stomach immediately was in the movies. We went to the movies right after. My stomach was just making so many crazy noises. I was so gassy last night, like. <gasps> so, <laughs> my next challenge to myself is to stay away from the dairy because it just doesn't feel good anymore. Like, why I keep hurting my body like that? Oh my gosh. I just ran the first complete mile in my life I've never run a mile before ever I almost could keep going but my whole body is red you see the proof is in the pudding baby all in 12 and a half minutes <clears throat> Hey everybody, so sorry for this bad camera angle. I do not feel like getting up to go get my tripod because it's gonna be short. I just wanted to say that today is Mark's like, I guess I'm a quarter of the way there for my two week weigh in. So far, everything feels all right. I felt really good. I don't remember what day it was, but I felt amazing like, just lean and just on my toes but it seems that as the week starts to wind down is when I start to lose my steam um ever since I started working out uh, more than three times a week I start to lose my steam towards the end of the week cheers to a new challenge and on Sunday I will be weighing in and We'll see where we're at from 2.22. Good morning. So today basically marks week two since I started my 12 week challenge. And I decided that it was time to get on the scale. All right. 
218. So 218 from my first real weigh in was 221. Still not bad, it's still down from 221. Now it's 218. Um, I definitely had a heavy meal last night, but I know it's still in my system and trying to work its way out. I feel it. How do I feel? I feel good. That's the first time I've seen the scale move in a long time. Took a lot to get myself to work out this week. And I don't want to lose that motivation. So I still push forward. And it's a good way to practice. It's a very good practice. Learn how to tell yourself, shut up, we're going to the gym, okay? No if, ands, buts, or what's. If you need to go home and get yourself a little nap, go ahead and do it, but you're gonna get up and you're gonna work out. That's it. Or if you need to switch up your rest days because you're that exhausted today, just still make sure you get in whatever days you've committed to working out. Mine is uh, anywhere from three to five, but it's four or five really at this point. All right, guys, I have a workout today with my sisters in possibly i'll film it because i want you to see this all right bye